you're watching the Dirty Rush. Enjoy. What is up, ladies and gentlemen? This is the Dirty Russian, the dirtiest Russian around, and I'm going to show you guys a first look at the new game mode from Call of Duty Ghost Drop Zone. This is on Sovereign, Sovereign, however the crap you pronounce it, no one cares. So I hope you guys do enjoy this. If you did, you know, do the usual comment, like, subscribe, tell me what to do next, tell your friends I'm here, and that you have found the dirtiest Russian around. So again, I hope you guys like this video, and let's get to it. Drop Zone's gonna be like Dom. It's up to 7,500 points, but instead of A, B, C, there's only B, and it spawns in at different locations. It's never in the same spot, and basically, if you're the first person in the drop zone, or if you're in that drop zone for a while, they reward you with care packages. It's pretty simple, and uh, that's basically it. Now, the thing that's funky, though, is that you can get stuff like ammo crates, night owls, maybe a juggernaut maniac, a satcom, even, you know, if you're on fog, Michael Myers, and all that good stuff, you can get Hilo Pilots and Hilo Scouts. I think it's a fun game mode. I don't think it should be ever taken seriously. It, you might want to go on there, as I said, to try out some of the kill streaks if you don't know what they're like, or just test out the game mode. I die from my own care package. It's pretty lame. So, that's really it on the game mode. Uh, you can still have field orders, and you can still get, um, as I said, those care packages, but you do not have your own kill streak so if you're on an eight kill streak no one really cares it's really all about the uh, care packages which I think is actually better because it helps you focus more on the objective so you can get those kill streaks instead of those people who just sit there and try to get kills in the game mode which I personally disagree if you're playing something like domination so as you see it's pretty simple and straightforward um, care package times it's the same thing nothing's different um, field orders same field orders and it's basically m mass havoc <laughs> and uh, craziness that's really all I have seen throughout this game play this was my first time so you know how it is but all I have seen so far is spawn death spawn death get a kill get a kill get a kill spawn death spawn death and everyone's rushing for this drop zone that's why I don't think it can be taken competitively because you don't need much skill to play it's something just to run in there and try your best I'm going to show you guys a little strategy right here it's you take the IMS if you get one luckily and you're gonna place it right next to the drop zone basically everyone runs right by it not seeing it and they get blown up by an IMS it works perfectly it'll get you two to three kills and I think that's better than anything so I mean nothing so you know it's pretty straightforward as you see there are my three kills there and it's really nice I'd always have an SMG or an assault rifle I don't think this is a one where you can have a sniper or you can have a marksman rifle again it's all your opinion guys though so you try out something new you tell me what you guys like put it down in the comments below nice double kill to finish off this gameplay i hope you guys did enjoy you can get many kills on this game mode and like always guys keep gaming